Hello students, welcome to the channel Top Gate. In this video, I will discuss one more problem of DFA. That is, to design a DFA which accepts all strings of A, B having even number of A's and even number of B's. Okay. Now, this question is very often asked question in university exams as well as many competitive exams. So, first of all, let's uh, see. Uh, what kind of language is uh, there in this one okay and then we will see what is the minimum string that is possible in this case and then we'll design a dfa for this one so in the language what we have so first of all what is the minimum string in this case so minimum string can be like if the number of a's is zero and the number of b's is zero because zero is an even number so the first thing is that we have to accept the epsilon second thing is that if number of a's is zero and number of b's is two okay after this if number of a's is two and number of b's is zero after this number of a's two number of b's two and after this we can have several combinations okay so let's decide first of all these uh, combinations and then we will design a dfa for this one so in this one what we have that is number of a's is 0, number of b's are 2. So, we will be having b, b in this one. What is this? Number of a's is 2, number of b's is 0. So, we will be having a, a in this one. In this one, we have number of a's and uh, number of a's as 2, number of b's as 2. So, we will be getting a, a, b, b. After this, we'll be, we have to accept b, b, a, a also. That is, in this one also, we have 2 b's and 2 a's. Or, we have to accept a, b, a, b or b a b a so all these strings we have to accept okay so keeping in mind these all strings we have to design a dfa first of all okay now what is the shortest string the shortest string will be this one and this one so in this one we have the length of the string as 2 the length of the string as 2 so it we know that if the length of the string is 2 then the dfa the number of states in the dfa will be n plus 1 that is 2 plus 1 is equal to 3 so we have to design a dfa in which there will be at least three states they can be more also but at least three states will be there so let's design a dfa for this one for this language okay so we have to keep in mind all these things we know that we have to accept the epsilon also that's why we will make initial state as the final state therefore q naught will act as the initial state as well as it will act as a final state that is we have we are accepting epsilon also so this is done so next thing is we have to accept bb and aa that is a minimum string in this case okay so for this one i'll make some more states say q1 and q2 okay it is saying bb so i'll go to q1 with b come back to q0 with b so we are accepting bb in this case correct now next one is so we are done with this one next one is a a a is we'll go to q2 with a and come back to q0 again with a a so we are done with this also that is a a is getting accepted and b b is also getting accepted now come to this one we have double a double b so double a double b how can we do this so a a b b so double a double b is also getting accepted now next one is b b a a so we have b b a a so b b a a is also getting accepted now come to this one a b a b so how can we accept this one because in this one we have two a's and two b's so technically it should be accepted okay so let's check it out we have a b a b so a and then what to do we don't have any move now so what i'll do i'll take one more state here that is q 3 and it is saying a b a b so a and b a and b so a b a b so a b a b is also getting accepted next one is b a b a so b then a b a so b a b a is also getting accepted so all the strings are now accepting in this one and this dfa is complete that is on q naught we have two paths one for b one for a at q1 we have two paths one for a one for b q3 two paths one for a one for b q2 two paths one for a one for b so this dfa is complete and this is a dfa for even number of a's and even number of b's thank you so much